from any Yosemite to Yosemite uh, 10.10.5, which is yeah, the latest one is uh, update 10.10.5. But I'm not going to update from here. I'm going to use the um, the combo. And you can download this one. Okay. You don't need to patch anything. All right. And this one is for Intel HD graphics 4400, which is the one that always got problem right here. Okay, so we're gonna click, uh, click restart to update. It would take about 18 minutes to 20 minutes to update. So make sure that uh, the AC is plugged in, okay? After the update, the Wi-Fi is still there, but the sound is gone just as expected. Copy Apple HDA and all the other CACs, original CACs, to a, a folder. And get ready to patch. Check the original version of the HDA that matches the, uh, the patch version then we will install the patch version to the uh, system. This patch version is from Insanely Mac, so you can go there and download, or you can go to uh, my website, uh, we will have the, um, the link to the Insanely Mac. You can use Kex Wizard to install. The next one we want to do is to repair the permission using this utility to make sure that this is good. Now we run cache utility to update it the system cache and then reboot. The sound is working now. Um, so let's check all of the graphics and make sure they work. The best way to check is to open um, with a preview to see how fast it is. All right. So make sure that we can edit. Okay. So close it. It's fast. So that's good. Um, no. check the um, there's no flickering um, also use uh, iMovie make sure that it doesn't crash so if the iMovie works then the QECI is working Make sure the uh, iPhoto is working without crashing or black screen. The graphic 4400 from Intel uh, for Yosemite from 10.10.3 all the way to 10.10.5 to work. Now the device ID you have to have a fake one at 0412 instead of the original one that we have seven this one right here release so if you open any of them So the version 1.2. The important thing is this. If you use this fake PCIe ID.kex, it's a version 1.2, you 
you have to load all the same version of 1.2 because the older one you can't mix and match them everything original the only thing you're gonna add okay so we're gonna add the fake HD 4600 and 4400 CACs and the fake PCI these two and look at this make sure is a version 1.2 and this one also a version 1.2 okay now this is for the graphics only okay so so actually I have a config file right here Now in the config file, under device, this is device, you have to add a fake ID, this one, and it have to be 0412-8086. And then at the graphics, you already have to use the this is a graphic key. You have to use platform ID 0826006. Okay, and set Intel key to true. Everything else is false, ATI or NVIDIA. Maybe we're going to just take it out also. Mine is uh, 1920, uh, 1980, a screen resolution. I use dual one. Okay, so that's it.